Happy Monday. Well, it's kind of deja vu all over again. We're talking about the municipal ban this week. Ah, uh, yes, the municipal ban. I really like the municipal ban. It's fun to go to the concerts, very professional. And, you know, you get to eat in the park and don't tell anybody, but you can drink wine there too. But it's the there that is really the issue these days. Got a couple of districts in the city who say, hey, how come we don't have municipal band concerts? So that brings up the whole question of why do we have a municipal band? Now I'm gonna make some people upset here, but the big reason most of them say we have a municipal band is tradition. It's all about tradition. We've had it for 108 years, and by God, we're going to have it for 109. All right. Good enough, but let's think about what we're doing here just a little bit. Did you know that it costs between $15,000 and $17,000 for every single concert? I'm not talking about a week's worth of concerts or a whole season. I'm talking about one concert. That's how much it costs to put it on. Now, it costs that much because we've got a bunch of very professional and very talented musicians putting on those concerts. Okay, good enough. But we had to, several years ago, when the budget was tight, cut back on the number of municipal band concerts that we had because it costs between $15,000 and $17,000 for each concert. So we cut back on the schedule. I say we because it was the city who did that. And we have been struggling ever since with what to do with the municipal ban. Now, back in the day when we were actually talking about maybe not having a municipal ban and maybe using that money to spread around to the entire city, we had just a huge backlash. And we had one particular councilwoman who really became the champion of, of the municipal ban. She promised that they'd set up a foundation and they'd raise all sorts of money. And within a couple of years, the ban wouldn't be taking any city money. That was her promise. Didn't happen. No foundation. And this year, the city will spend $275,000 for six weeks of municipal ban concerts. The Friends of the Municipal Ban are raising another 85000 Good stuff. That's why we have a sixth week now. But did you know that it costs between $15,000 and $17,000 for every single concert? A lot of money. Figure out, do we really want that money spent that way? Okay, if you do, fine. But let's think about it at least. And let's not throw us under the bus if we happen to say, you know, maybe it ought to be something we think about. Let's not say that we're not patriotic that we're terrible people to actually threaten the municipal ban. Just saying, we ought to talk about it. Because it costs $15,000 to $17,000 for every single concert. Thanks.